Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome to the theater. I'm happy to report that my arms don't hurt as much as they did yesterday. Ah. But while I was falling asleep last night, they definitely did hurt a lot to the point that I was like, I don't know where to put these. Anyways, I am at the theater, obviously. It is Saturday, and today is my last day where I actually know what I'm working. <laughs> Who knows what next week will bring? I don't know. There was a staff meeting on Monday that I hope is going to bring me a lot of answers. Otherwise, all I know is that I'm working on Tuesday because that's still my regular shift. I just don't know for how long I'm allowed to work. I don't know if it's like four hours or six hours, or eight hours, and I don't know if I get to work beyond that. So be interesting. Anyway, I am here today to work six hours because I have six hours left and you can be certain that I'm going to use the six hours available to me, milk it for every penny. So I have to fix the paint job that I was doing the other day because I don't know, I, I'm pretty sure I mentioned it, but I was painting the inside of a windowsill and I was like, mm, this is not the right color at all. I found a potential color that it could be, but who knows? And then I told the tech guy that I would clean the stage. It's like using this fun machine, which half the time doesn't work properly for me, but he needs to paint the stage. And so I was like, well, I'll, I'll do the prep for you. So that's, those are two of the things I need to do today. Other, other than that, I'm not really sure, but I need to fill six hours. The stage will be about an hour and a half. The painting will probably be total like an hour and a half, depending, who knows if I can find the right color or not. So I'm gonna start with that after I have my breakfast drink, but I'm gonna go have my breakfast drink first because I'm pretty hungry and I really don't wanna work today, but it's the last option <laughs> for the week. So here we are. And then I think later on, maybe have a nap. We'll see though. I don't know. I don't know, man. I just, I don't know. Well, hello, it is four o'clock and I've been home for just under two hours. I came home and I had to, eat food right away because I was dying. I'm still dying. I have a massive headache and I'm going to have a nap here in a second, I think. But while I was at work, my mom went shopping because yesterday her boyfriend was like, I think there might be a meat shortage soon. We need to get more meat. Take my bank card and go. So she bought a lot of food today. My, <laughs> my freezer up here is full. It's got pierogies. It's got lasagna, it's got hash browns of varying types, it's got tater tots, it's got a lot of stuff in there, and uh, the two freezers downstairs are pretty much full as well. I wouldn't say it's like to the brim, but very little could fit in there at this point, but that's fine. It means that we probably won't have to shop on Thursday, or if we do, it'll be for very few things. I mean, obviously, I'm going to check with my grandma and see if she needs anything. She did say with her last grocery shop that she'd be good for quite a few weeks, so several weeks, so like who knows, maybe she's fine or maybe she's not, I don't know, but it'll be a perfect time for me to go and get stuff that I need for Blind Channel because I normally start to shop for Blind Channel in May, just getting like toiletries and all that kind of stuff that I need, but that won't go bad. So maybe we'll do that. I need to start making a list. I have to place a Lush order because I love their shampoo bar, so I'm gonna do that and I think I'm just gonna bring toothy tabs instead of actual toothpaste, um, you know, so <laughs> we'll see, but that's an option. I think I might also place a tart order, but I can also just place a tart order while I'm out there. The shipping isn't too terrible to go out to Blind Channel. Actually, I think if I order over a certain amount, it's free shipping, so that's cool. But yeah, so a couple things to start getting me started, and at some point I need to <laughs> put those clothes away, and I think I'm just going to get rid of my sewing machine box is under there because I don't think I need to keep it for any reason. But yeah, I'm pretty exhausted, so I think I'm gonna have a nap, but then later, I think I'm gonna keep working on this. It's going well so far. I did have some French knots there that I ripped out because I did not like them. I also ripped out French knots that I'd had on this island. I don't think I ever showed it. Um, and I might rip out these yellow French knots, but they might be okay. I'm getting better. See, like, these French knots, these pink ones here, were the most recent ones I did. And they are much better. That looks orange on camera. I promise you it's pink. Anyways, we're still learning on how to do flowers. I haven't really done a lot of flowers, but that's cool. Anyways, I'm going to change into some pajamas, I think, and then climb into my bed and hopefully get an hour or so of a nap because I'm just dying. I'm just dying. Hello, it is the next day. Good morning. I had a nap yesterday, woke up, had dinner, and then I was still feeling pretty terrible, so all I did was work on this buddy here and um 
watch a bunch of stuff on my Netflix watch later list because I just did not feel like functioning as a human. And it's currently 20 to 11. I think I woke up at 10 or just before. I was just not feeling getting out of bed. I just climbed out of bed. I was like, what can I find on the internet? So that's where we're at. I'm still feeling a little blah, a little bit better than before, but still not great. But hey, it is what it is. I think I'm probably gonna go get make food. Go get make food here shortly, but I don't know. I just kind of want to like, Murr. I just want to but this is where we're at. Still not feeling the greatest. I, I kind of want to be productive today though, so I'm gonna write a list, which is something I haven't done for the last two days, I think. So write a list. I need to do invoicing today. I need to send my invoice today. I need to edit the vlog from two days ago. I should clean my room because it's becoming a bit of a disaster. All that fun stuff, but that can wait a bit. I'm still like, eh. <laughs> Alrighty, well, it is math time. It is 10 to 3 and I have been super productive for the last little while. I did a lot of cleaning so I had a bunch of junk over here. I had my sewing machine box. I had clothes. I had a rug that was here but it was awkward because my chair would keep hitting it or it was too close to the door so I just put it outside the door. I was thinking. So I hung up all the clothes that were here. I got rid of the sewing machine box because I I love my sewing machine. I got rid of all my recycling that was under there. I've kept these for can recycling because all the can places are closed right now. I got rid of my garbage. My bed is made. The only thing that's a bit of a mess is this, but I'm going to keep working on that today, so it's fine. I also got the vlog uploaded. I did some other computer work that I had to do. I'm doing great. The only things I really have left to do today that is on my list is invoicing. <laughs> I'm just trying to like work up the want to do it. Exercise, uh, shower, and embroider. So we're doing very well, especially considering, like I said, it's only three. I think I kind of want to force myself to do the invoicing right now because that would be awesome. <laughs> just get it out of the way. But then I'm like, maybe I should force myself to work out right now and then shower and then invoice. I don't know. That's where I'm at. I think I might try to find something to just casually watch for a bit and maybe do a little bit of embroidering. I've, I'm not done the first two islands, but they're kind of at the point where I want to move on, so I started to kind of sketch out what I'm thinking for this island. Um, I'm leaving the one with blind channel on it till last because I don't know if I want to do something special. I don't know. Anyways, that's where I'm at, so I think I'm going to work on that for a little bit and then kind of see how I'm feeling after that. Alrighty, well it has been a little bit more time. I did a workout. It was a leg exercise and I can already feel it. <laughs> I was in the shower and I was like, oh no. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> tomorrow's probably gonna go well. I'm gonna try to drink a lot of water today in hopes that that minimizes the impact, but we'll see. I'm just snacking on some cheese because, mm, cheese, and I was doing some more embroidery, so I started on the bottom island there. It's coming along. It's, I think it's starting to grow on me more. <laughs> I still have a lot of fill-in to do on the two islands that I've finished, but that's fine. I sent my one boss an email asking him if he knows when I'm coming out to work and also like how the new POS system's going, because if you remember in, it feels like ages ago, I think it was beginning of February, I went out to Blind Channel to set up the POS and do all the inventory and everything. And um, then it turns out that the system he was sold on couldn't do what we needed it to do, so he had to switch. Just found out that all that work I did didn't transfer over. <laughs> ah, so that's fun, at least the inventory. I don't know if the descriptions and barcodes did, but yeah, so it sounds like there's gonna be work for me to work on that when I go out there, so that's fun, but yeah. Um, sounds like about the same arrival time as last year, which I think was like June 25th-ish. So who knows? Th that's always my thought. It's like it's going to be around that time. But yeah, so that was nice to hear from out there. See how things are going. Sounds like it's interesting. He also switched a payment system. Then he's like, I could write you paragraphs on how much I hate this. So 
yeah, we, it might be switched back to what I'm used to by then. But anyways, I'm feeling good. My arms hurt a little bit too because there's a little bit of arm stuff in that leg exercise. And so I feel like I'm going to be struggling a lot tomorrow. Fortunately, I don't really have too much planned for tomorrow. I have a staff meeting in the morning, which is going to be virtual. And um, yeah, I don't know. Other than that, anyways, all I have left on my list is to embroider, which I could cross that off at any point because I've done quite a bit of embroidery today and do my invoicing, but I think I'm going to do my invoicing after dinner because it is a quarter after five now. My mom should be home in about half an hour and then we're having tacos for dinner, which I'm very excited about. Um, but yeah, so I think I'm just going to probably watch something because I don't want to work on my embroidery project while I cram cheese in my face <laughs> and then um, maybe get back into that if I have time before dinner. Yeah, feel, I'm feeling like I've had a pretty productive day today. My room I'd say is clean, except <laughs> before I jumped in the shower, I just dropped my clothes on the ground, so I have to pick those up, but other than that, we're doing pretty all right. Well, 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 guess what? It is quarter to ten, and everything on my list is done. I just finished up invoicing, so that is good, and I finished it up right until today. There is nothing in between, so I can take a couple days off before I have to get back to that, which is so nice. I love it, and um, the embroidery has gone well. I've pretty much done the main parts of all the little islands, even the ones up in the corner, except for this main island here. Well, they're all kind of main islands, but this is the one that I was waiting to do. And I just have to do the fill in on the other things, which not so bad. So that's very exciting. And um, I don't know what I'm gonna do now for the rest of the day. I don't feel like embroidering anymore. Maybe I'll you know, climb into bed. I don't know, maybe I'll place my Lush order because I've been thinking about doing that. I don't know. We got options. Maybe I'll go eat ice cream. Also an option. My legs have been mm for most of the day. It's, um, they aren't sore. I suspect that will come tomorrow. They've just been kind of useless. Like, hey, could you step? And they're like, yeah. So we'll see how that goes. But yeah, feeling, feeling pretty good with all the progress I've made today. My room is still nice and clean. And I'm clean because I showered. Today, today was a good day. Today was, I think, the first day in a very long time where I set a bunch of stuff on my list and I got a bunch of stuff done. So that's, that's pretty awesome. Hopefully, at some point in the future, this can become a priority. I read a, um, I think it's like an Instagram post or something the other day, and it was very, I can't remember what it was, but basically the gist was if you can't be creative right now or you're struggling with X, Y, and Z, it's okay because your brain is going towards thinking of other things. If you can't think of goals in the future, it's okay because your brain thinks it's safer to just think short term. And so that helped. So I think that that will come along in the future because I think, you know, that's long term. Anyways, I'm going to go for now, but I just want to share how excited I am when I've got so much stuff done. Yeah. Alrighty, so it is now the end of the night. It is 20 to 12 and I've I went down and I ate ice cream. It took forever to get out of the deep freeze and it was totally almost not worth it, but also it was really good. Anyways, I am watching Cheer. I know I'm super far behind this, but it's become my new Netflix show to watch. I watched an episode of Ozarks this morning, but I don't know if it's really my thing. We'll see. I'll try another episode at some point, but right now I am feeling Cheer. I am on episode three and uh, going strong, but I think I'm gonna go to sleep now. I'm probably gonna switch this onto my iPad and cuddle up under all my blankets. And by all my blankets, I mean the one blanket. <laughs> and I'm gonna go to sleep. So with that, I'm gonna see you tomorrow, maybe. <laughs> Good night.